today we're in Norco, California. We're gonna go do something that I've been wanting to do for a very, very long time, and that is go hike to Pumpkin Rock. For those of you that don't know what Pumpkin Rock is, it is a huge 15-foot rock in Norco, up on a hill, and volunteers paint it every year to look like a pumpkin, and it's October, Halloween season, perfect time, right? Perfect time to go check out this pumpkin. So we're gonna go do that, and I wanna show you something super cute in Norco. Norco is Horsetown, USA, super patriotic little city. Um, I just, it's so cute. So I can't wait to show you what's on the street when we get up there on their main street. I'm gonna try to show you, I'll flip the camera around. Here we are, we made it to Norco, Horsetown, USA, right there. Okay, you guys, look at the street. See how it's red, white, and blue? Isn't that so cute? All right, we're almost to the trailhead right now. It's already getting warm. You can hear the little dogs barking. This is right next to the pound. This makes me so sad. I wanna go rescue them all. I would if I could. Pumpkin Rock Trail Gate opens 7.30 a.m. to sunset. If you look right up there, you can see Pumpkin Rock. That's where we're going. Will we make it? I don't know. Let's find out. This is a fun little plaque here. It says, how long does it last? Leave no trace on your visit. So it says paper. It takes two to four weeks to decompose. Hard plastic container, 20 to 30 years. Aluminum can takes 200 to 400 years. And glass bottles takes thousands or millions of years. That's insane. Boy Scout Eagle Troop put this here. That's pretty cool. It's good to know. All right, we've been on the trail for a little bit now. It's like a steady incline. Look at this. All the way up. Getting a good workout today. And that's a good thing because we're gonna go get a little special treat after this. And I'm excited about that too. Can't wait to show you guys. Sure is pretty up here. Can't wait to get up there and see the view. We got a little tip from some hikers that were coming down. They said when you get to this USA sign, take a left. You can go left or you can go right. And they said the left one is a little bit less of an incline. So we're gonna try that today. Look at this cute little tree right in the middle of the trail. Grow, little tree, grow. How's it going, Tinsley? Okay. It's pretty steep. It's actually very steep. But we're gonna do it. Walking, walking, walking. I see you, Mr. Jack o' Lantern. We're coming for you. You're doing good, babe. She's not having any part of this. Pretty hard. Oh. Hey, little hole. Gotta watch where you're walking. This is super fun. I totally recommend this trail. To anybody who wants a good workout, it's super steep. Really steep, actually. But it's a lot of fun. You can bring your horses up here, your dogs, your kids. <laughs> it's fun. Speaking of horses, look. That's the way we should be doing it. Just another couple hundred feet. We're gonna be there. We did it, Tins. We did it. Fun. Oh, check these guys out. Mountain biking. How fun would that be? Good hey guys. Here he is, Mr. Jack o' Lantern himself. Look at how big he is. Oh my gosh. 
This is so cool. Love the American flags up here. Give you kind of an idea of how big the sky is with me standing next to him. Tinsley sitting next to him. Look at that. So cool. Okay, so the view, amazing. Let me flip the camera around. It's so pretty up here. On a super clear day, you'd be able to see a lot farther. But you can still see quite a bit. I'd like to take a moment to remember Lance Corporal Kareem. He was from Norco and he was killed among 12 others in Kabul, Afghanistan back in August. He paid the ultimate sacrifice. All right, so we made it up here, hung out for a little bit, enjoyed the view. Now we're gonna start heading back down. It's not very crowded today, um, which is nice. It's a Friday morning. Um, I was told by a friend that they came over the weekend and there was a line going down the hill just to take your picture with the pumpkin. So, I'm glad we were able to come when we did and I do recommend coming during the week if you want to spend some time with Mr. Jack Lantern back there. <laughs> so, let's start our hike down. You ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we just came down there. We're working our way down back down to the car and I just wanted to take a minute to show you. So this trail, there's a neighborhood that backs up to it and I don't know if you can see in the distance there, but there's a Mickey in someone's backyard and it is so cute. So shout out to those guys for bringing a little bit of Disney in our lives, even though we're not at Disney today. Let me see if I can zoom in. So cute. Hey Mickey. Working our way back down the trail still. Tell you what, it's a lot easier going down than it is going up. Woo. It's a beautiful day though. So now that we're coming to the end of this trail, I just wanted to tell you kind of like what I got from it. So it's very, very steep um, in some places, um, but you can definitely bring your kids. These people had a stroller up here, so I mean, it can be done super sketchy but I don't know if I'd do that but kids no problem you just have to go a little slow and definitely bring water on days like today because it's hot but overall it was a really fun little trail and you get to see pumpkin rock at the end of it so it's totally worth it in my opinion so if you're ever in Norco you gotta come check this place out it only took like I don't know maybe an hour and that's getting up there, hanging out for a little bit, relaxing, and then coming back down. That's not bad. We just got back to the car. We're gonna go get our little Halloween treat now. I was gonna take us to Krispy Kreme Donuts because they have Krispy Scream Donuts right now that are super cute, but the closest one to here is 30 minutes away and it's like bumper to bumper traffic because there was an accident. So we're probably gonna skip that and we're gonna go get a different treat. This is one of Tinsley's favorites. So let's go. Horsetown USA in full effect over here. We have made it over here to get our special little treat. What is it, Tinsley? Where are we? Minchies! Minchies! Check it out. Minchies. Here we are. They have little sample cups if you want to try something. And this is the cup you use to fill her up and then you pay by the pound. Boss baby. Let's see what they have today. Let's see if they have anything for holiday. Oh, here's a Wednesday's favorite. Milk, chocolate, and almonds. Cousin It's favorite. Haunted Harvest Pumpkin. Boss Baby's Banana Pudding. Here's a featured flavor, peanut butter cracker? What? Okay, let's see what we're gonna get here. I just got a sample of the Haunted Harvest Pumpkin, so let's see what that tastes like. That's okay. Yeah, 
kind of good. What are you going with? Yeah, Oreos. Ooh, Oreo Froyo. This topping bar is insane. Kid Mickey? I think so. So you got some gummy bears and mini M&Ms. Yum. Mm -hmm. So it's by weight, so they weigh it, and then you pay, and then for Halloween they have these cute little spoons. Are they adorable? Okay, so strawberry, when you get strawberry, you have to put fruity pebbles on it. You just have to. When you get banana, the granola goes on top, and vanilla gets the plain old peanuts, and that's just the way I like it. It's perfect. What'd you get? Mm -hmm. I got full Oreo. Mm -hmm. I've actually never had Oreo before, so this is going to be a new. Mm -hmm. And then, I don't know, I've never really been a fan of, fan of sprinkles. Yeah. Too hard, huh? But how's the Oreo ice cream? Or Froyo? Bomb. Bomb. All right. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. We had a really fun day. Hike was good. Froyo was amazing. So, if you did enjoy it, please let us know by giving us a thumbs up and leaving us a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. See you later, alligator. Extra wild crocodile. <laughs>